Let's go. All right, so here we go as round one gets underway. Two world-class level strikers here, and the expectation is we're going to get a kickboxing match here in the octagon. Yes, we are going to get a striking match. One guy is very good at kicks. The other guy has unbelievable hands. Let's see what type of attack is going to win the battle of two great stand-up fighters. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. That one snuck in. Nice strike. How good is that right hand? Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Oh! He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh! Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting. Oh! Goes down again! Back to the feet! Start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, hey, well, nice job to land the knee there by the taller fighter. And I think I just heard Daniel Cormier say, I wish I was a little bit tall. You're a baller. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. Oh, huge right hand! Well, he's up, but he is hurting for certain. The finish could come at any time. Oh, straight right. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. Tower, oh my goodness! <laughs> Beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight.